Hey humans! I just thought I would jump on really fast. I don't have much time at all, but I wanted to do for Tutorial Tuesday some stuff about brows and what kind of I do. So I'm looking for the color right now, but I'm going to show you what I do for my brows um, pretty much on a daily basis. Let's use this color right here. So I'm using, I'm using Bird, which I actually haven't used a ton lately, but um, Oh my eyeshadow it looks different in the picture. <laughs> I'll fix it in a moment. See that divot? I just have to fix that. Sorry, fixating. Oh my gosh, I don't have much time. So I'm going to use Bird, which like I said, I haven't used a ton recently, but things are changing. My um, skin is a little bit lighter, and so instead of using Trust, which is super dark and also out of stock, I'm going to use Bird. And I'm going to take a angled brush, so if you have an angled brush like this one, and then just dab into the, the tip of the brush. And what you want to do, and you can actually like, I'm going to use a spoolie, you can actually brush your, your brows out first. Because what you want to do is you want to start from the bottom inner corner of the brow. So if I were to hold this up, you could use a pencil, brush, whatever. If I were to go from the in, like the edge of my nose to the inside of my eye, right here is where my brow should start. So I just kind of like lined that up and then I pointed to that spot. So I want my brow to start right here. I'm gonna make a little line. So right now that looks like, ooh, that's a little too low. I promise it all comes together. And like, if you've got little hairs that are on the outsides that, you know, 10 years ago you would have plucked and now brows are cool, <laughs> and you can use those to your advantage. So you take, and I'm just going to get a little bit more, you take from there and you actually go to where your arch should be. So again, on the outside of your nose, this time line up with your pupil or your, yeah, your pupil, right? I hope that's right. Um, and this is where your arch should be, right here. So I'm going to take and I'm going to go straight through the brow from the bottom to the top of where that's supposed to be. And look at like what a dramatic difference that is. Like that already brings it up so much more. And when I'm not going like this, it just looks so natural. And that should be your strongest line. So that's why you apply your product there first. You don't want crazy strong lines on the top of your brow. I'm gonna get just a little bit more. I'm gonna start from where I just was. And again, if you line up on the outside of your nose to the outside of your eye this time, this is where your brow should end. So I'm gonna take from where I just was and come straight down to that spot, okay? Now in this step, I sometimes get a little bit more product on, but I don't really recommend it if you've never done your brows. Go back to where you started and start feathering up the product you already had there and then feather this part down. So you kinda want this to come up and this to go down and you can brush it through once you're done, and there's my brow. And it doesn't look that much different than the other side. It shouldn't. It shouldn't, you shouldn't be drawing like brows that don't exist for you. If you are a fair skinned girl, do not be putting on black brows. If you are a dark skinned girl, do not use Bird. I'm using Bird right now, but it would be way too light for you. You want them to kind of look how they're supposed to look. Now this is an eyeshadow color, and all of our eyeshadow colors are actually on sale right now. As I talk, I'm gonna do the next one. They're on sale right now for $8. So if you're looking for a specific eyeshadow color and you're not sure which one's best for you, here's your cheat sheet, okay? If you are really fair, I would go basic. If you're kind of in the middle like I am, I don't remember what I did. Did I do this part yet? I think I did. <laughs> I will. If you're kind of in the middle like I am, you could go bird. And then if you're a dark girl or you just like really dramatic brows, you've been doing brows for a while, cool. I recommend cool. Um, I have seen people do their brows with Salem. I don't really love Salem as brows. I think it looks too fake. You really want to make your brows look natural. So like when I went to the bottom here, I was feathering up in hair like strokes because you want it to look like your brows. You don't want it to look like somebody else's brows or that you're like, I've been watching a lot of grays lately. Like you don't want to be Christina Yang on, on the day of her wedding seeing eyebrows. So you really just want to make it look like your brow. They're not drawn on. You're using the color just to enhance the brows you already have. 
and then there you go. And you can see like they're not perfectly matched. They're not supposed to be perfectly matched. Your brows are, this is what I've heard, they are sisters, not twins. So don't freak out if they don't match. Um, and if at any point you don't love something, like right now maybe you feel like this side's just a little too low, because that's exactly what I was just thinking, then you just like take a little bit off. Back to normal, no big deal. And then something that I would do to accentuate the brow, and this has nothing to do with brows in and of itself, but I would take a highlight or a illuminator color. Actually, you could take a highlight color. I would take an illuminator color and really relax your brow. And this part right here that sticks out, it's part of your brow bone. Put this lighter color right there just to kind of highlight that area. You want to like bring attention to the brow bone so that as I move my face, these glitter together because this is the other spot where my illuminator is. And that's brows in a nutshell. If, like I said, you want to go grab some colors, the link is above. They're only $8 while supplies last and then they're going to be out of stock for a while. So go grab them while you can. I'm going to go out now that my brows are on and my makeup's done and I will see you guys later.